Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm gonna be talking about um how to tell someone's a fake thief or not. You know, um, I like to call them the fake thief foxy boys. And I really, this is why I kind of like keep getting drifted away from these games because those people. You know, can so what I'm just gonna show you today, like probably like I don't know, not really exact number. I'll put in the title how much, but uh, how much it, like you know how to. Know if you're a fake default or not. Um, so yeah, let's just get on the video. And before this video starts, I want to say I'm really sorry for my um, like going away, but like I've been gone for like two weeks from so I just haven't been uploading. But no excuses. Let's get on. Oh, number one, it's if they have the rust bucket pickaxe, which, or not pickaxe, the back bling. Rust bucket back bling. It's like it was in the shop for free from April. April. Um. April like mm, like tenth or twelfth like the nineteenth or something like that. I don't know how long, but if because that means they've been playing for a couple a really long time and it means they're all actually decent. Some people have it, got it, and like stop playing for a while because of some reasons or something. And it actually might be that no, most of the time it's that. Oh yeah, the thing that drove me to this video is because I be, I keep getting killed by fake defaults every single match and actually like two like I was I was playing actually after before I was recording this video. I actually just got killed by one, and um, it, I can tell because this game's the number two, and I can tell you why. I thought they have like this banner if you think when they kill you. If I mean, especially if they have like the party bus banner, I don't know, like, season one, or I don't know, some people have it, or they don't. But if they have like the platinum, the platinum around it, that means they're either like over 40 or 60, and like the 60s or 40s, and then 50. And if they have gold, it means they're also really, that means they're pretty, they're not splitting over too much, too. I really didn't put too much, but that means they're you. That means they're pretty good because a real default when I spend when I have 63 levels. Because I'm pretty sure without the battle pass, it's pretty hard to level up because um, it's just from because in the battle pass you get um, XP from challenges, which doesn't mean that I mean because if they have the battle pass, they shouldn't be running a drift. Because a real default, a real default doesn't like. Want to have no really? I mean, some some defaults are still rock the skin. They don't want to buy skins or wear skins because, like, Tifu, I'm pretty sure. Like, there's like free skins that you could get or skins that you buy, but he decides to wear the default. And I mean, if they're, I mean, Tifu, I'm not gonna say he's a fake default because he actually doesn't have skins. The definition, of, the definition of a fake default in my book is like when they, when they have a bunch of skins and they're just spending TV default just because they like to do it just to. No reason actually. I don't know. The default is actually a really good skin actually, especially on the one I'm wearing right now. That's my favorite default skin. But you know, it's kind of annoying when I'm just going there and a big default comes around. Uh, some defaults, um, another like number three, is some defaults also wear like like other back wings. Like sometimes you wear a pickaxe. Like last time I went to a default that have that has like um like a. Uh, like a like Magnus pickaxe, something like that. <clears throat> and, was, and number four is not really know if someone's like if okay. Usually what I do is if I'm playing the playground feel, I ch I look up the, the default's name to see if they're like actually faking trolling, and if, or like if I'm playing duos with the default because actually this happened like a couple weeks ago. I was playing um, I was actually playing duos with the random, and he was acting like a real default. I looked him up and I knew that he had like a bunch of skins and all that, and so I just played along with him and. And then I just, yeah, I knew I already looked you up and all that. And so just, I recommend, I mean, if you think if it's not that bad, but I make them, it just it really annoys me. It might not annoy you guys, but it just annoys me so much. And I really don't know. Maybe I just want to do number, I just want to do number five just so I can make an even list. Okay, I, I guess it's counts as one, but the number five is the misunderstood defaults. In the shop sometimes it's like commando or like, the, like it's this default skin to put clothes on. It costs like 800. And the most common one I see is the commando with the wings. And you know they're really try hard and good when they have that, so you should just like not even try. Usually anyone with wings has it, but like if someone pays eight dollars to buy a default skin, I mean that's kind of bad. But you know those those are I mean I can, I'm just gonna count that as one. But you know, so yeah, that's really it. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys forgive me for not uploading. My videos are just the five minute mark and it was stop because I have to trim it because you can't do five minute videos without paying for Vivo video. But that's it guys. Peace out and love. Wait. At the five minute mark.